Hello everyone, this is Natalie with the Marketing Resolution YouTube channel. Thanks very much for watching today. I am pleased to introduce you all to a colleague of mine in Moultrie, Georgia. This is John Forlan. How are you, John? Hey Natalie, I'm great. Thanks for having me on your program. Oh, I'm so happy to have you. First things first, I gotta tell you, I'm crushing a little bit on your Southern drawl. That's <laughs> Thank you very much. I, I was born and raised in the South and um, actually was in Paris a few years ago and on the tube and uh, someone said, uh, you would be from the Southern United States. So my accent definitely gives me away. It does, it does indeed. That's really unusual. Um, most of the time uh, traveling around the, the, the continental European countries, they can't tell the difference between a British, Australian, New Zealand, American accent at all. So props to the person who identified you as a Southerner. That's, that's really pretty impressive. So, well, I, I wanted to chat to you today about the practice that you've built. And you've been at this for decades um, and come highly recommended. And I know this because, you know, I, I ask around a little bit. But you, you come highly recommended, not just as a litigator, uh, but also as a mediator and an arbitrator. And because you and I have chatted, I know that you really love mediation and the services that you can provide to the folks there in Georgia. Tell me a little bit more about your practice. Okay, great. Well, uh, as you said, I've been doing this for about 30 years uh, as far as practicing law. Uh, my mediation practice and arbitration practice is um, about 20 years old. Uh, I, um, I love what I do. I'm very passionate about it. Uh, it seems like both in my litigation and in the uh, alternate dispute resolution that I do, the common theme is uh, really helping people in the broken places in life. And so um, my, my practice is really a calling to me. Uh, I really love what I do. I can't imagine doing anything else. And um, so my practice is primarily in South Georgia in the United States. Um, Moultrie is located somewhere between Atlanta, Georgia and Tallahassee, Florida. Uh, I am um, involved in about seven different circuits in South Georgia and some of my cases are uh, privately retained uh, primarily through other counsel and some of my cases are court annexed. Many of our uh, courts see the value of dispute resolution so um, I'm on the um, certified list with the Georgia Supreme Court for mediation and arbitration. And I love what I do. Well, it's, it's really, really obvious um, that you love what you do. And, but this is a great industry. It's easy to be passionate about helping people. And in Absolutely. fact, you love helping people so much. That's the name of your website, lawyershelpingfamilies.com. That's correct. So, I mean, it's, it's um, no surprise to me that that's really what, what drives you and what, uh, what you're impassioned about. Do you have a um, you have a typical client? Do you hear all kinds of different cases? Do you hear commercial cases, family cases? What kind of cases come through your office? All right. So primarily, my uh, mediation practice involves uh, family law, and that might be a typical uh, divorce dispute, uh, custody dispute, or it might be something such as a dispute involving a, a family estate. Um, in addition to that, um, I do uh, personal injury uh, dispute resolution um, and also um, business dispute resolution. So um, in, a, in a rural area, um, there's a lot less specialization than you might find uh, in a bigger city like Atlanta. Sure, sure. That, that makes sense. But I have to assume that that gives you, though, a slight advantage in that you can be really evaluative. You, you've got a, a vast, um, a vast, I guess, resume, a vast knowledge of a lot of different things because you have to become an expert on so many different things. It also means that in a small town, in my experience, you get to know the ins and outs of the other lawyers, the judges, the court system. And so you can probably be of great assistance to your clients in helping them figure out the system and, and you know, really uh, the value of a case. Yes, I think um, if I had to describe my approach, it would probably be a hybrid between uh, facilitative and evaluative. I think one of the great advantages of being a practicing attorney is 
uh, you, you do get in the trenches, you know uh, how judges and juries are looking at the issues at hand. And um, to be able to uh, give people a fair evaluation, not from the perspective of an advocate, but from the perspective of a neutral who's trying to help the parties facilitate a, a resolution, it really does add value to uh, being able to help the, get these cases settled. Yeah, that makes perfect sense. Um, you know, it's, it's really nice to be able to walk into an office and have someone understand your case, understand the system, understand, you know, all of the, like you said, the ins and the outs and, and someone who's been in the trenches, especially someone like you who's been at it for decades. So that's, that's an excellent thing. What's your favorite part about, about your mediation practice? You said you like helping people, but what's the, what's the best part? I think um, definitely the best part is helping people avoid the litigation. Uh, so most of what I do is fighting with other lawyers. Um, you know, in our adversarial system, um, even though I'm passionate about what I do, sometimes it's, it's not pleasant, uh, the, the day-to-day -day grind and fighting it out in court with other lawyers. And so to be able to offer people uh, a much better solution where they can choose the outcome you know, it's really, a, it's just really a win-win situation. And I, and I think it goes back to the, the real advantages of mediation uh, over litigation. Uh, and I like to tell my clients that there are three primary advantages. Uh, first of all, they get to own the result. Um, if they go to court, they don't own the result and either a judge or 12 strangers are going to determine uh, the result for them. And um, it's much better if people can craft their own solution to their particular problems. Second, I think the mediation is so much more uh, efficient and economical as compared to litigation. Um, you know, people spend a lot less dollars and cents and a lot less emotional currency. Um, there's an old saying in our area, um, love is grand and divorce is 20 grand. So, um, you know, people are going to spend a lot less money um, at mediation than they are in a divorce trial, for example, or a personal injury trial. Um, then I, finally, I think the third big advantage is the uh, confidentiality component. Um, not so much in a, in a larger community, but in a small community like we have throughout South Georgia, um, trials are kind of the talk of the town until the next one. And, um, you know, if people go to court, uh, no one has to buy a ticket. They won't serve popcorn, but anybody can come and see the show. So in mediation, people get to keep their business, their business. And so it's a very confidential process. And I think for those three reasons, um, it's a great opportunity for people to, to resolve their cases. And that's, what I think, what makes me so passionate about it and why I love it so much. Yeah. Well, those are... Not just three reasons, those are three really, really good and important reasons that mediation uh, frequently beats out uh, the litigation process. And, you know, being a gladiator is, you know, it's, it's interesting, it can be exciting, it can be lots of things, but rarely is it the best answer for the client in the room. Um, and, and so I, I really appreciate that you've, you've come over from the litigation side to join us. <laughs> I'm not sure if I've completely made that, that, uh, I, I'm still in the middle of those two worlds. I think I haven't made the exodus entirely. That's all right. We'll keep working on you. <laughs> well, John, I, I, um, I want to thank you so much for your time. Um, and, and I know you're a busy guy, but I really appreciate you spending a little bit of time with me. Uh, between Georgia and France, there's, there's quite a time difference, and uh, and I, I, you know, I can't say thank you enough for for setting aside the this time in your morning. So uh, again, for everybody who's watching, if you haven't already, please subscribe, like, and share, and be sure that you visit John Forehand's website, helpingfamilies.com. He's an excellent resource for my 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 fellow Americans in the South. Thanks very thank much. I appreciate it, Natalie. Thank you very much. It's my pleasure. That's me signing off. Be good humans. <laughs>